I am so excited for the Vitality Super League. There's been a lot of hard work, you know, behind the scenes as players. We are so grateful for everything that's gone on and we just cannot wait to get back out there on the court. Just kind of bring some more netball back to the community and for people just kind of watch it on their screens again. We just can't wait as players get out there and put the performances on for them. The young girls really stepping up now. It's quite an exciting team. A lot of similar players that were there last season. So I think we got about four games in. Some young ones that were really stepping up and we've got that again. So there'll be lots of challenges for kind of that 12 and who gets picked for that, especially that starting seven. But then there's lots of returners. Obviously we've got Beth Cobden coming back after being away for a few seasons in Australia. So that's really exciting for her. So a lot of familiar and kind of old heads, but then also these younger girls fighting and coming through. So I can't wait to see everyone out on their court this season and see what they can do. We know that we've got that depth. We've been trying it out in pre-season. I think it just proves how far the Vitality Super League has come with all of the names that we now have, not just kind of the import players, but also the homegrown girls also that are here. The, the Super League is just growing and growing each year. We're so grateful for the support from Sky Sports to have this broadcast deal. It's just amazing. People will now see just phenomenal women and athletes putting their bodies online, working hard each week, not just one game, but getting all those games across the channels and YouTube is, is just massive. It's a step in the right direction and for us to keep moving forward and growing the sport for kind of the future young girls coming through. The amount of support that we literally get through Twitter and social media is just amazing. The messages, it just means so much with all the support. We're definitely aiming for top four. We always strive for that, but obviously it, it's to win. Obviously we've been in quite a few grand finals and we've always come up short in, in those kind of last few games. So I think it's important for us to start well. There's not one team that you could write off this year, but you could take your foot off the pedal. Every game will just be a battle and everyone will be trying to put those performances out for the win. So, yeah, I can't wait. Who doesn't love an upset and an underdog, though, as well, to see, to see what happens?